Welcome back to my channel. So today is a review as well as a makeup look which I did which is right now on and it is using all Maybelline products. The Maybelline Spring Summer Collection Rebel Bouquet. I totally love the concept because every single year you just have like same colors going on. There's nothing new launched and even if it is we don't know. So Maybelline launched their new Spring Summer Collection and I totally love it and you will see what I use and how I use it under that um, collection which they just made and trust me I think 90% it all the products are really amazing because I've used it on me so if there's some eh and nah so you can just see it in my video um, going forward so that's it so um, I'm just gonna stop talking right now so you guys can continue on to my video Thank you so much for watching and watch until the end because I have a giveaway and I'm picking two winners. So details would be in the bottom bar below as well as at the end of the video. Thank you so much. Bye bye. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's like literally 6 in the morning or like I should say 7.30 in the morning. But then I wanted to get this video up because I don't miss my schedule. So today we are talking about the Maybelline's A New Spring Collection. Maybe I'll record an intro later <laughs> than right now. So um, I have all my notes here. So Maybelline has recently launched this new spring collection foundation, which is called Maybelline A Dream Satin Sin Skin. Sorry, this is what it looks like. This foundation is priced at 700 and or 645, depends where you buy it from. And the shade they have six different shades, where which goes from fair to medium dark. So they have pretty good uh, skin collection, and I don't know why crows are cow cowing. So let's see how this applies on your face. So obviously I've already moisturized my face. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take my beauty blender and I'll just put one pump. And I'm in the shade B3. It does look air whipped. Like it, it's like really like fluffy rather than a flat foundation. So I'm just going to take that on my beauty blender and what I'll do is I'll just put some dots on my face and see half of it. If you see half of my face, obviously there is a difference. It does hide my red spots. And obviously I'm not trying to achieve a really like flawless look. But I'm just going to see how it looks with one layer. I think it does a pretty decent job covering up everything. And FYI, this is a shade lighter to my skin tone. Um, this was actually sent by Maybelline. So I can't do anything. I didn't buy anything light. actually air whipped liquid foundation and it does feel like air whipped because when I pumped it out it was really fluffy so it's like a mousse and a foundation kind of consistency and I pretty much like their coverage and they have amazing shade collection so I think you guys should definitely check it out and obviously after I apply my foundation I will um, um, use my compact. This is the packaging that it comes in. This is a really classy packaging. I really like that and the dream satin skin two way cake. And this is for non cakey ultra breathable satin skin perfection that lasts all day. Okay, so basically, the, it comes in this is the actual packaging, and I'm in the shade B2. And they have these holes here, and let me tell you why. So, they basically they give you a sponge, you can use this sponge as wet or dry. So, you can see these holes right here, it is actually for the sponge to breathe. So I mean I think that is a really like that is a pretty good deal to do. Packaging looks like this is my cake and this is my sponge. Comes with a really huge mirror and I love that. You can also use the sponge wet or dry with this. So my beauty blender is a little damp. I'm just going to test it a little. Not like I'm not I'm not gonna like go in there really like look. It's just a little damp and it picked up a lot of products. So let me see where I want to cover up. Probably there's a redness here, so I'll try to cover up that. Oh my god, it does work. it works both ways it works uh, with the dry uh, sponge or as well as with the damp beauty blender or your damp sponge so this is a pretty good deal like I like this this is neat now we're done with the face I'm just gonna put some blush on 
and again I'm just gonna use my Maybelline Cheeky Glow really quick the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to take the Maybelline New York um, two-way cake and I'm just going to put that in my crease with the help of my uh, crease brush I'm not going to do any heavy makeup or anything like that. I'm just going to put this in my crease and later whatever is left I'll just brush it. That's all. That's it. That's all I'm going to do. And then the next thing that they have in their collection is one of my favorites, like a favorite, all time favorites is going to be this Maybelline Colossal Liner. This is in the shade black and this retails for about $4.25. So what I will do is I will do my classic wing liner with this and let's see how easy it is to apply. Can you see that? It's like really really like jet black. I love this liner. I totally love this liner. Oh my god such a perfect wing I love it and use it like so okay and I can also use it like this so it depends however you want to use it whether you want to keep it thin whether you want to keep it thick so it totally depends upon how you use it love 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 this now the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to use my Maybelline Colossal Cold Liner and guys, they have launched four new shades. They have, um, this one is the crushed emerald. They have green, they have blue, they have turquoise, and they have gray. Gray is my favorite, and I'm going to purchase it if I like this one. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to keep it very simple. I'm just going to put this in my waterline. I will also apply this under my waterline. Apply some really nice good coats of mascara and then we're done and then I have to finish my other eye obviously. Love it. So what I'll do is I'll finish one of my eyes and then I'll come right back. So I finished both of my eyes. Let's get to something very exciting and I love. What do I love after Kajal? It's obviously my lipsticks. Like these are the bomb lipsticks. I love them. The packaging is really cute. I'll probably put a picture here and there. So that was the packaging and I am sad that it actually comes off when you take off the sticker. It actually comes off and it looks normal like normal Maybelline sensation and like you're hopping So these collection. lipsticks are for 450 and they have the six spring shades launched. Why does the dog have to bark when I'm filming? Why? So they have six shades like a spring color like spring shade and this is for 450. So I have two shades here, one is Rebel 2 and another one is Rebel 5. So let me show you how they look. This is another orange lipstick after Hyper Orange I actually like and this is Rebel 5. They don't have a name for it. And the next one that I have is the Reb 2, 02 and I love this color. And this is what it looks like, this is a really nice pink color. I love pink if you don't know. So I'm just going to take my uh, Rep 2 and I'm going to apply that on my lips. So this is how the lipstick looks like. So this is my finished look with all just Maybelline products and that is the spring collection. I believe you can achieve uh, many more looks with the turquoise kajal and different types of kajal that they have launched. Out of this entire collection, what do I like? These three are my utmost uh, favorite. This is going to be my foundation, it is going to be my colossal liner and it is going to be my cold kajal. I love these three things because you know why? Because all I need is a foundation, the kajal and the liner and I'm done. I'm good to leave out of the house. If I need some redness, I'll probably take some lipstick and put it on my cheeks and I'm good to go. So that's it. They also launched uh, these new color show Maybelline Go Graffiti shades and these are really pretty i mean you can see them i have it on right now and these are these retail for 145 for 6 ml and i totally love the concept i have never seen a uh, 
big brand company do this but i've seen the local ones but then obviously they don't stay long and then it's no point like wasting your money on it so i truly love it the color combinations are amazing again i believe they have eight shades in this so i think you guys should check it out and this one is the blueberry bombshell 08 And now to the fun part, to the giveaway. So um, when I was approached, I was like, I want to do a giveaway for my uh, subscribers. I have uh, two winners, okay? I have two winners who will win two Maybelline lipsticks, two nail polishes, and a liner. So basically, you get five products, and everybody can try to win, okay? The winner will be selected on random basis. So if you want to get your hands on the new Supreme Collection Rebel, okay? Then all you have to do is you have to be a subscriber to my YouTube channel first. Second thing you have to follow me on Instagram and then you can enter either way or you can enter both the giveaways. I don't mind. So uh, there's one winner from Instagram, there's one winner from YouTube. So leave your comments down below for the next video request. I think that's the easiest thing that I can tell you guys to do. Or probably I will actually ask you guys to leave me a question that you guys actually want me to answer to make a new video out of it. So yeah, so one winner from Instagram, you have to follow me on Instagram. I'll upload a picture, so you have to leave your comments down there. So um, that's that, and thank you so much, Maybelline, for sending me out these products, and I totally love them. I this is what I came up with. I love them. I think that this review has helped you guys out, and you guys should go ahead and purchase what I told you to. So. That's it. Like and subscribe. Until next time.